so, so today today's a special day what what is today today is my grand reopening I've spent uh, a lot of time and money uh, revamping my office and it's been over a year since we moved in here uh, I'm it's not a long an OCD or perfectionist necessarily but it took us a long time to feel like we can finally say okay grand opening so <laughs> anyway we have uh, a stem cell presentation over here that we did earlier today we're gonna do another one uh, just to help people understand what uh, what we do and specifically in this case what stem cells can do awesome and uh, we had some healthy of course I know I already filmed all the grub oh, yeah. and everything that's awesome you know uh, that is so the exception cool. of the starchy carbs over there that were for the early morning coffee crew and stuff like that <laughs> most of this is super super healthy. yeah the salmon was awesome uh, we got our um, sweetened with erythritol only and that's the only really safe fake sugar uh, portable <laughs> snacks and uh, somebody making anyway, you said you've been in here before right yeah, yeah. Well, this, this, I want to talk a little bit about all the services you provide over here because you really made this place kind of like a one-stop shop for everybody and I, and I think I don't think people are understand or realize what you're offering here so let's talk about every well, the single idea thing. was it was actually given me by uh, a famous person who's one of the most prolific uh, producers in the world who sat down with me one day and said you know why don't you and such and such another doctor who's uh, actually the top of his game get together and uh, you know make life so much easier and his opinion is very very successful he's not only a producer he's successful in a lot of other things uh, he's a multi-billionaire um, uh, for privacy reasons I can't say who it is but uh, he's very very successful at rebuilding companies and anyway I thought who better to listen to than someone like that who uh, suggested one-stop shopping you know so that I mean how many times have you been to a doctor's office and uh, oh here's a referral for so-and-so that's right a card and you yourself who want to get it done don't follow up for whatever reason for six yeah. months, if at all. Yeah. It's so much easier if you walk down the hall and say, well, here, yeah. you know, meet so-and-so if they're available, or here, let's sign you up. You can go ahead and get your therapy here. Yeah. Uh, so anyway, that was the idea. I can't get enough space in Santa Monica, especially with as expensive as Santa Monica yeah. space is, to do everything. But I picked some of the things I thought would be uh, of interest to particularly my patient uh, base, sports medicine and regenerative medicine both. So. Um, <laughs> cryotherapy at work right now. So we have the cryotherapy machine. We use U.S. cryotherapy, which is awesome. considered, in my opinion, and Isn't those and many other, probably the best in, in the country. Wow. Very, very safe. It's electrical. It brings you down to 150 below uh, temperature-wise. As you can see, it's a, it's a big machine. Yep. You can push out like you would push out of your shower. Uh, so it's very, very safe. Yep. Uh, it's full body. It's not nitrogen based, uh, which has the advantage of you know avoiding any potential for burns. Um, the idea is just to get your skin temp down below uh, what it normally is by 25, 35 degrees to get the therapeutic effect. So you don't need to get you know below 200 degrees and risk uh, some other deals. And I'm not bad mouthing nitrogen. It's just I think this is safer. And there are certain nitrogen machines which are done properly. Uh, there's one up on La Cienega up here which is full body and it uh, is very very safe. We also have infrared, have infrared sauna here. Uh, there's other therapeutic benefits to uh, not just sauna, but infrared sauna, the, the heat penetration, which has great value too. That's what we have over on this side. Awesome, awesome. And then, um, um, you mean you've got a blood order? You've got our standard exam. You said you already gave him the tour, right? Well, that was like you were like in the middle of it, so I just want to okay. let people know. Well, there's somebody know. in here. This is our uh, physical therapy room, and uh, we've got Mary who does. Um, uh, she's a medical esthetician, no, and she does everything exactly from um, can, uh, collagen induction therapy to just cosmetic makeup. Uh, nice. That's redundant. Um, what's the word? Uh, you know, permanent makeup, stuff like that, and removal of, of, of certain makeups as well. You know, the the, the, the tattooed oh, uh, okay. ma makeup. So she's a specialist there. Anyway, she's she's at work as we speak. Awesome. Um, let's see. Well, we've got our OR here. Yes. Which uh, right now is uh, in the middle of this. We're, we're using it a bit uh, right. for today for storing a few items we just got. But this is where um, I extract fat, mainly to collect stem cells. We wow. can collect uh, mesenchymal cells from adipose tissue fat, and we can also trim down some of the excess fat that people might not want necessarily care yeah. yeah so kind of kill two birds with one stone but also you were telling me you use this room to do um gyno gynomastia yeah no removal. it's part of that well I, I trained with a guy who's who's famous for being the best at what he does uh, alberto hoyos in colombia and uh we using vaser equipment which uh 
this piece over in the corner here, mm. we can do what they call a high def um, lipo, which means we could actually we're not we're not debulking, we're not taking a big cannula and taking out a lot of fat. It's for people who really want to just carve up. Uh, you know, there's a little bit over here that you might want to get rid of, and I think we talked about this at one point. You know, at 225, you got that at 215, you get rid of it, but you're a little too light. So yeah. you could say 225, and we just trim off that extra, and it's usually wow. just a matter of Touch has nothing to do with your fault, it, unless you you know chose your parents the way you did, and you're stuck with it. And yeah. you take credit for choosing your parents that way. It's a genetic thing where uh, again we can make up for it, but. Again, I encourage patients to save the fat because we can harvest the, the mesenchymal stem cells out of it and use those for a lot of things later. Wow. Uh, but yeah, we can also do gynecomastia surgery as part of that with the that's, laser equipment. That's awesome. It's very helpful because a lot of times when you when you do gynecomastia surgery, uh, you know, you cut out the breast tissue and a little fat around it and you leave a divot. Mm -hmm. uh, with a laser, you can go and sculpt around the area so that you get rid of, essentially you can get rid of all the fat so there's no, no, no divot that can be made because there's no... Um, there's nothing left to leave a hole in. That's sure. awesome. Yeah. Yeah. No, it makes a big difference. Very I think. cool. Uh, here we have our IV therapy room. So we do a lot of uh, IV nutrition here. We're set up to do what uh, looks like obviously a Myers cocktail. And mm -hmm. uh, I don't know, this is an athlete who's going to follow up with some uh, glutathione, which is great to preserve. Uh, it's very hot right now. A lot of people do that. Uh, for heat? Glutathione. Um, um, like a lot of athletes, a lot of competitors. Yeah. For, for everyone. Because yeah. Uh, if you use reduced, of, of course, uh, glutathione uh, and vitamin C, you'll recharge the vitamin C, which is a great antioxidant with the reduced glutathione. So it potentiates that effect. It's probably the most powerful uh, natural, if you will, because uh, we make our own glutathione. We have to have, ingest vitamin C, but uh, self-defense against you know viruses, bacteria, fun fungus. Um, so a lot of athletes come to use this because uh, we can. It helps protect the hemoglobin, um, you know, uh, and the red cells, red blood cells in general, um, and um, helps with recovery uh, with athletes. Normally the dose we give will give you, I, I recommend people do it, you know, no one, you don't need to do it more than once a week. One interesting note though with the glutathione use um, with athletes is you'll find that uh, because glutathione is sulfur based and the tests we use to um, assay hemoglobin, you'll, it'll look like your hemoglobin has been dropped when in fact it's still there, it's protected, but because of the, uh, the combination of the use of glutathione and the, and the testing reagents, it'll show as reduced, hmm. uh, the hemoglobin that is. That, that ran us for a scare years back when we first started using this. <laughs> this is supposed to help, this is supposed to preserve the hemoglobin in America, not make it go the wrong way. <laughs> uh, anyway, just a fun fact for, for uh, case you're in jeopardy. Yep, but, uh, awesome. Over here we have, um, here's where we do a lot of different therapies, including um, one form of stem cell collection, which is uh, using, um, well, a very new machine, the Spectroptia, but an old technique we used for stem cell uh, transplants. Uh, we sit someone in the big comfy chair here, and we hook them up uh, to each arm, and we pull the blood through after um, using something called Neupogen or filler stem to stimulate your own production from your bone marrow of stem cells into the blood for about three or four days. Anyway, then we collect them using this, so we have all three stem cell types. Um, and they're yours, and then we store them. They're, they're not something that as of yet we can replicate, but um, we've got those for you in case, you know, God forbid you get an accident or you have a shoulder cleanup that might be healed better with some uh, stem cells introduced either during or after the procedure. So um, anyway, that's what this is for. We also do PRP uh, therapy here, platelet rich positive therapy. We've got the game ready for just uh, in case you need to come in here uh, post-workout and ice down and the cryotherapy is too short for you, only three and a half minutes. Here we can ice you for you know half an hour or more. Wow. Our Normatech, I think, uh, is in one of the other rooms. Well, of course, we do compression therapy too. And speaking of compression, we have the hyperbaric oxygen uh, therapy chamber in here, which, I, yeah, nobody's using right now. Um, but here we have the soft shell. Oh, wow. Um, because, um, well, that's what we have room for, honestly. But we still get the therapeutic effect. We uh, This one's adjusted for seven PSI, which is, you know, below 30 feet. Um, and, and an hour treatment, um, you know, from beginning to end. So you're at least getting 40, 45 minutes of compression uh, using, um, you know, uh, pure or close to pure oxygen. Uh, you get the therapeutic effect, which includes 
uh, stem cell production. It wow. stimulates, uh, we've seen a study showing that it'll stimulate the bone marrow to produce more stem cells, as well as pushing uh, you know, the compressed oxygen through the, the smallest of vessels to, uh, to help therapeutically. For, for in terms of recovery, this is one of the best things. Uh, all my bicyclists come in here and use this because yeah. Um, you know, normally you do your, uh, you know, your flat road work, and you do some hills, and then you might go back and do flats and hills. By the fourth day, you're smoked. You do your um, hyperbaric oxygen every day uh, for those three days. The fourth day is just like the first day. Wow. It's pretty amazing the way it works. And we don't know if it's necessarily just the ability to help reoxygenate tissues that much quick, more quickly or the stem cell release, but... Uh, Definitely uh, not just a marginal but significant difference if you do your, your uh, hyperbaric oxygen therapy while training hard. Um, well, for, for anything, but particularly for my, my, uh, my uh, bicycle athletes. Are you going to be able to handle all that new uh, clientele? Because you're busy as it is <laughs> right now. You, you had to bring that up, didn't you? <laughs> uh, we're I mean, working on that. And in okay, all good. sincerity, I mean, you do hit a hot spot. Um, you know, I apologize. Uh, you know, it's a good thing. I mean, that means people like to be successful. It's a good problem successful. to have, but yeah. it's still a problem uh, to yeah. not be organized enough to, to manage uh, all the. Uh, well, you get a new office manager now. You just brought in. Yeah, we're stepping up the game. Yep. But, you know, uh, always finding good people is the hard part. I know. And, uh, I know. and organizing, which it all falls on me. I'm the guy. I'm supposed to have a. Well, I, I was a CPA before I'm a doctor, and I actually <laughs> have a business degree, so it does fall on me. But uh, it's hard to practice medicine and do anything but that. You, you know, yep. I think. Um, you, know, you you have to you have to focus on one thing and do it the best you can, and that's one thing I've learned the hard way. Yeah. You know, I hire a CPA now, a, a JD CPA, former IRS um, <laughs> uh, consultant. So um, because I can't do that stuff anymore, I, I, and I like what I'm doing better anyway, practicing yeah. the medicine. So anyway, yes, thank you for pointing that out. That we uh, we we've got the not the best reputation for uh, for keeping up with the business, but we're going to catch up. And I wasn't saying that for that. I'm just well, I'm I just I'm just so it. glad <laughs> that uh, that obviously. You know, if you're getting busier and busier, it's because people really took to you. And I think the videos have, uh, have helped a lot, um, you know, p for people to know how knowledgeable you are and how great you are at what you do. And now this new clinic. So I think it's great that you'll be able to bring, bring so many more people and clients, you know, that will be able to just focus. But I think once people find someone they like and trust, they want to stick with that person. I think you're right about that. So I think the fact that they'll be able to just stay here with your staff, with yourself, with the people you work with, I think it's great. Well, thanks for yeah. saying so, and that is the intent. We yeah. want to be uh, we want to be thought of as very trustworthy, and yeah. uh, but that that like I say, that extends to you know to getting your refills done on time and everything else right too. So we're, we're working on improving growing that, pains. That. Yeah, yeah. yeah, growing pains. Yeah, but <laughs> no, we look forward to That's being awesome. able to accommodate as many people as possible and expanding therapies. I mean, yeah. with medicine project uh, projected to do uh, what what it is um, with all the new treatments from you know not just stem cells but CRISPR. Uh, gene splicing and, and all the other stuff we, 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 we have going on and, 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 and small things that, you know, I say small things, things that we think of as not necessarily groundbreaking but uh, having so many different options for for helping. Uh, you know, we have the standards like uh, cortisone shots but we also have, uh, you know, PRP is ubiquitous used now and it was like uh, just five years ago that people were like, oh, it doesn't even work, and yet now we know absolutely it does work, mm -hmm. and uh, I think even now in some places it's being covered by insurance, so awesome. uh, just the number of therapies that are, are beneficial is, is now increased so much, that's what I'm trying to say is the exciting part. So the more we can, um, we can collect those that we know work well and, and have it all in one spot, the better, right? That's and awesome. Treat everything. Doc, give the address of the clinic real quick on top of the uh, 2701 Ocean Park Boulevard. Suite 114, Santa Monica, California, 90405. Do you know the phone number? 310-452-3206. Boom. <laughs> thank oh, you, thank Doc. You. <laughs>